Hello friends, welcome to our YouTube channel Electronics for You. In this video, we are going to solve one numerical of a electrical network using Laplace transform. Here is the numerical. For the circuit shown below, determine the current when the switch is moved from position 1 to position 2 at t equal to 0. The switch has been in position 1 for long time to get a steady state values. Here you can see that this is switch 1 and this is switch 2. We have to determine the current for switch 2. Now let us ex uh, now let us consider this current as I of t. To find that I of t we have to consider first for the uh, switch is at position 2 and then we will consider the initial condition for switch 1. If the switch is at position 2, we will have circuit like this. Now let us apply KVL. If we apply KVL here, we will get 2 I of t plus 0 0.14 di by dt equal to 20. The current flowing through inductor is given by L di upon dt. So it is 0.14 that is the value of L di by dt and the current flowing through inductor it was 0 current flowing through register it was 2 ohm resistance and it is I of t so the potential drop for the voltage uh, for the register it is 2 into I of t plus uh, for inductor it is 0 0.14 di by dt and the last uh, um, that is the uh, supply voltage it is 20 now now apply laplace transform now let us take the laplace transform for this so we will have two I of S plus 0.14 the Laplace transform of di by dt it is S into I of S minus I of 0 where I of 0 is the initial color and for the 20 it is 20 upon S <coughs> now we have to find the I of 0 because this is uh, the initial current and to find the I of 0 we can use the initial condition that is for position 1 switch for position 1 with initial condition it is 2 ohm this is 10 volt supply and as this is the inductor it is actually short circuited because for t equals to 0 for t equals to 0 the change in current is actually opposed so it is short circuit and this is 2 ohm resistance and a 10 volt supply therefore the current passing that is I of 0
the current passing will be given by V upon R that is 10 divided by 2 which is 5 ampere. Now let us put this in our, our equation number 1. Sorry, this is not our equation number 1. This is our equation 1. And let us put the value in equation 1. We will get equation 1 equal to 2 i of s plus 0 0.14 s into i of s minus phi u equal to 20 upon s. If we simplify it, we will get 2i of s plus 0.14 si of s is minus 0.14 into phi u it is 0 0.7 equal to 20 upon s so after simplification we will get uh, if we simplify it, we will have 2 plus 0.14 s and after bringing uh, 0 0.7 to the right hand side, we will have a 0 0.7 s plus 20 divided by 0 0.7 s equal to 0 0.7 s plus 20 divided by s into 0 0.14 s plus 2. Now if we are having uh, 0 0.14 common then we will get uh, here it is phi u s plus 142.8 divided by s yes into s plus 14.28 now by by partial fraction i of s is equals to a upon s plus b upon s plus 14.28 where a is equals to now let us find the value of a for partial fraction uh, it is s into i of s which is equals to for s equals to 0 now s into i of s it is uh, phi u s plus 142.8 divided by s plus s into s plus 14.28 it is for s equals to 0 this s and this s will get cancelled and uh, as we put the value of s equal to 0 here we will get a is equals to 10 now similarly we can find the value of b and b is equals to 
एस प्लस फोर्टीन पॉइंट टू एट मल्टीप्लाइड बाय आई ऑफ एस फॉर एस इक्वल्स टू माइनस फोर्टीन पॉइंट टू एट एंड इफ वी यूज द सेम मेथड हियर विल गेट आई इज एस बी इज इक्वल्स टू फाइव एंड देर फोर विल हैव द इक्वेशन ऑफ i of s equal to now put the value of a and b here it is 5 it is 10 upon s plus 5 upon s plus 14.28 if we solve uh, if we take uh, the inverse laplace transform we'll get i of t is equals to what is the inverse laplace transform of 10 upon s it is 10 And plus five e raised to power minus fourteen point two eight t, and the unit for current is ampere. So I of t is equals to ten plus five e raised to power minus fourteen point two eight t. This is the final answer. Thank you.